the relationships that are so vast. And it's not that you have to have a relationship, it's that it's an option that you have to have a relationship. And if you choose that option to be in a relationship, then it is a path towards liberation. And it's not the easiest path towards liberation either, but it's a very rewarding path towards liberation. So you can uh, become united with one person and in that way become united with the universal force, with the divine force. You can uh, merge into another person and that is the same thing as a merger with the infinite once you have achieved that. So it's, it's, it's rare, but it works. You know, we say men and women a lot in here because it's just for simplicity's sake, but we know that there's other relationships and in all types of relationships, you have a, a yin force and a yang force and a lunar force and a solar force, okay? So even though you have men and men, women and women, we say man and woman because it's easy, but think of it like that, solar and lunar, uh, yin and yang, right and left. You could just have a relationship and do nothing else, you know, uh, hypothetically. You could have a relationship and do nothing else and you could liberate yourself that way if you perfect it. So the idea is you use these teachings to merge as one soul in two bodies. Instead of soul here, soul here, soul here, the, the one soul in two bodies is held and then the merger takes place.